So this is the very start of the game. Snoring Valley, the little tutorial area. Oi! What are you doing down there? What? Why are you on a rock? Why wouldn't I be on a rock? Hmm. I want to jump down so we can see your character. Superhero landing. You got lots of eyeball badges on your uh, thing. Yeah, it's to know that God is always watching when you're in pajamas. I mean, it looks like a peacock exploded into a bunch of Cthulhu shit and you just put that on. That's the look. Your Did head you is know? also abnormal spot. Oh, yeah. Here, here's my tune chat. We are of the Dragon Empire. A fallen tree, boss. Oh, yeah. What you gonna do about it, huh? I cast Identify Tree. It's a species called Jumpus Tutorialis. And weirdly, it only grows in this one valley. How weird. That is rather strange, huh? The edge steel beckons you forward. This steel feels like... Found a melee weapon. Oh, boy. Love a good axe. Great cleaving, hacking... Even a good old-fashioned chop-chop. Yeah. A cave mouse sits covered over nearby. <laughs> if only you could get yeah, Smash it. things! Smash them! I got an axe now! Get that tree! Don't ask no questions. Magical. A true fate maker knows when to stand tall and when to crouch. Yeah, work them sweet glutes. And if you get a running start, and Working nice, glutes. you'll slide around like a cool action hero. Cool action heroes do slide, it's true. Another yes. waystone guides your path, but reaching it will mean going through a pack of nasty, pinchy crabs. Oh, pinchy boys! Oh, I gotta deal with these crabs! Smash them! Smash them! Deal with crabs is a problem. You have defeated the crabs! Luckily, they were... Oh yeah, take that crabs. I'm gonna be a badass And bunkers and badasses you can be the bunker Then we got all our bases covered That's all friends uh, no. roll. What if I want to be the badass But I already called dibs so That's how dibs work. I don't know Did we establish the local dibs rules of wonderlands? Dibs work the same in Wonderlands as everywhere. It's universal dibs. I don't know. We're going to have to contact Tina directly about these rules. Uh, I'm going to have to defer to the... Sounds like some the, bullshit. Not the DM, but, you know... The Bunker Master. The BM. Ooh, a thing! Woohoo! It's a gun! Two and four shot burst. Yeah. Four more bursts. Alternate firing modes. What do you think, chat? Have you all played this? Did you like it? Didn't like it? Thoughts, comments? I like having seven classes and being able to mix and match them. Yeah, mixing and matching them rather than individual skill trees for every character is pretty great, I think. Come here, skull bombs. Yeah, the game really picks up pretty quickly after this little tutorial area. Holy crap, they might reach the Dark Master! I gotta book it! Yeah, 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 whatever you say. Yeah, 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 yeah. There's a loot chest up on that tower. Get the loot! Loot! Faithful servant of the Dragon Lord! Faithful servant of loot! Or I'll make you a skeleton too! RN Jesus be with you! That's like a magical shield above your health. Yeah, it is. Yeah, you can grab ledges and mantle in this game. I believe this is the first game to let you be able to do that. It makes a lot of those little platforming stuff a lot less pain in the ass. 
And there's a fair bit of that in this. There's the actual D20 dice that, that you go and pick up that increase your loot luck, which is an actual stat. No. Well, GG guys, that's the entire game. I hope you enjoyed our stream. We're stuck forever. Oh wait, barrel. Barrel. You thought. love barrels. Explosive barrels. Barrels are your favorite thing in this game. Why don't you tell everybody? Let's they're, they're never friends. speak of barrels again. Oh, they're going to be coming they're up a lot. They're evil. No. They're creations of evil. So you won't see as Who many- Who needs to transport that many materials that they need a fucking barrel? Come on now. Shenanigans. And chat, you won't see as many loot dice in our playthrough because they're account bound. So I have found them already on my first character, so they don't show up for me. But they will show up for Big for the ones that he doesn't have yet. So I'll be able to see them to point them out. But yeah, you can pop them. It's a little loot explosion that increases your overall luck stat for finding things. Oh, portal! Portal boy! We are playing on intense difficulty, the hardest difficulty. But first playthrough still seemed pretty easy compared to a lot of the other games. Yup. Level two. Level up. Woo. So with level two, we get our first action skill, which sure for my do. character is called Cleansing Flames. Fate Maker summons my hammer and slams it into the ground, dealing fire melee damage and creating a massive fire nova, dealing fire ability damage. Let's see, mine is a polymorph. Fate Maker turns an enemy into a skeep for a few seconds. If they're immune, he casts a free spell and gains two sacks of spell weaving. While active, me and allies have a chance to cast a free spell after dealing gun damage to the target. Guaranteed the first time. So I can turn stuff into a skeep. Skeep, skeep. And then I also get in, put in a skill point. So we want to get some more cooldown because we're going for dual spell action. Wait, we get more than one point to start with, don't we? Oh, we need to put in a skill point. Let's see here. Reload speed, magic bullets. Crit. I think we want to go spell gun damage to start with. What's up, lady? Is, your, is that your husband? Is that a bad day, peasant ass peasant? Get up. Here. We'll save you. This. I think this might help. See, it worked. That's how you perform CPR in Wonderlands. I'll help. He's still down. You're not breaking ribs. You're not doing it. He's still down. Do it again. He's still down. The tomb is inside. I don't think you're doing it right. You, you gotta do it harder. Oh wait, right. I'm not supposed to use a sharp object. Uh, I think object. I just chopped him into pieces. I mean, his one leg is already a peg leg. I'm gonna say that was like that before. It's not our fault. Time to go. We'll never talk yeah. about this again. Remember, we're heroes. I'm a hero. Somewhere beneath these ruins. Find him, Shit, boy! Wow, that lasts for a while. I should save that for like big boys, huh? Get him, Barrel! <laughs> barrel one shot! Ooh, barrel! Take that, Skella Bombs. <laughs> Let's get him, big. What's your character's name, by the way? Pinhead. Hmm. Because you have lots of things in your face? Yes. See, my character is named Ice Ice Baby. 
I bet he's gonna do something with ice. Ah, dude, you don't know. You don't know. You just don't know, okay? Give us that money. Money is a lot bigger deal in this game than the previous ones. Cause it's something like 300 million to fully upgrade all your stuff. Poetry page. Ooh, what's that scrawled upon the parchment? Verily, tis a poem. Surely the author would be glad to see its safe return. Verily, I say unto you, you dudes. Keeps Chest of loot. So, Tina. Maybe after this quest, I could be the bunker master. I've been working on the <laughs> It's got orcs <laughs> and <laughs> He's funny, isn't he? <laughs> it's fine. <laughs> Ooh, look at this. Oh, it's cool. <laughs> Tina don't play no more, okay? But it's all good. I got mega tons of questicles simmering up in my brain sauce, baby. Ah, uh, all right. So we get dual weapons. Now with our shield. I shall uphold my own. Bursty boy. First ice weapon. The SMG rolled with ice. It has begun. <laughs> you know what else is icy cold? My drink. Time to crack a cold one with the boys. You're the boys. Happy Friday the 13th, y'all. Oh yeah, this can koozie is like one of my favorite things. How's that picking up? Friday the 13th in Lake Crystal instead of Crystal Lake. I mean, you're not wrong. So maybe we'll have like a superhero to come save us instead of a serial killer to come kill us. Eh, yeah, I don't count on it. The last of the hero bloodline sits in her ancient throne, her bones clutching a dusty spell book as though awaiting a destiny. Killer bones! Okay. Well, this place is super grim. I love it. Grab that spell book. Yeah, ammo seems to be a lot more easy to get than other games as well. Oh, spells. Spell love it. You can cast the frost spell continuously. Ice magic is extra strong against the undead. They got none of that greasy flesh to keep them warm. Woo, right. greasy flesh! That's right, I'm gonna be the undead slayer. Around here somewhere. So I'm kind of like a paladin. Smash time. Hi -ya! <laughs> Owner dry air of the crypt! Smells of old stone. Old stone instead of gold stone. Sucks. My servants suck. And prophecies? I spit upon prophecies. We still need to get the poetry pages and scrolls for each character. For six generations. So we should make sure we score those. Stupid prophecy. The heroes must guard over these lands, lest a great evil rise again. Well, guess what? These lands suck. I'm getting out of here. Yeah, time, just rumble. give it to the Moving evil. That seems to come from all around you. Screw these lands. The forces of evil us. I found it! A tomb inside of a crypt! The pack is hiding. I am coming, my dark master! He's gonna resurrect the Dragon Lord. That's the exact opposite of what we want. We True. Get in there. Yeah, I'm pretty sure that character is voiced by Andy Samberg. And the other one is, uh, what is it, Wanda Sykes? Who plays Fret. And the uh, same voice actress who's played Tiny Tina. I am a fate maker. You have answered. Smartly, baby! The carven door to the Dragon Lord's tomb crumbles! Woo! Alright, hold on. Let me look at what my spells and stuff even are that we got. So, it's a magic barrage.
I'm gonna push rocks over the cliff. Don't forget, if you go in your mail, you can claim your Dragon Lord packs because we bought the Holy Crap edition of the game. So it gives you some random guns that are fun. Well, I don't know if I want to do that at level two. Because I might be like level 10 and want a good gun. You can do what you want. Let's go! We Superhero landing. Nice. Ooh, cutscene. Scary. Books upside down. I got a special figurine for this guy. One second. Yeah, if you ever played D&D, this game is Rising greatly pays tribute to that. Most loyal undead soldiers. It's Ribula. Slam in the back of my Ribula. Dude, we ought to get us a rib. I mean, for real. I like ribs. Oops. I'm dribbling. Kick his ass, dude. I didn't do it. He has multiple phases? No. We didn't kill him yet. Ow. What? That was in the middle of my swing for my finishing move on Ribula. That little skeleton had to poke me in the back. Oh, I ribbed him. I killed him with a skull. Do you think he's salty about that? Seal him away or whatever. Come on, bud. Get down here. You and your big ass. Yeah, not happening. Come on. The fate maker never beats the villain in the first quest. Still, you're stronger than the ones she sent before. Oh yeah, that's right. I wonder. What do you wonder? I killed him. Did you see? I cast my spell, and then he disappeared. Now that's his ghost talking. Right. I just beat the game. Yes. Ooh. Booty chest. Come on, booty. Booty, 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 booty! Man, what do we even start at for inventory limit? 36. Now let's find all the goodies in here. We don't have to come back and get them. Fate Maker's journey begins as so many do, with a heart full of fire and dreams of dragons and magic. It will end only in one way, with the ultimate defeat of all evil. Ultimate defeat! The dragon lord has escaped! Wait a minute. Oh, I squished Did a crab. He said? Defeat us time, Fred? defeat us. Neighborhood? I know where he's headed. He's after Queen Butt Stallion. To warn <clears throat> Queen Butt Stallion of the dragon lord's escape, you must travel Mission far. reward, green shotgun. To the capital city of Bright. Might be Ice cool. green shotgun, parable of murky depths. Mine's parable of the void. Magical blast with its own shield. All right, got a shield upgrade. I'll give you a good home. Jump, magic, jump. Woo! Time to go, boy! Overworld time! This is a really interesting take on the tabletop version with the overworld. It ends up not being that impactful later on, but interesting concept. Woo! I love table overworlds. We got to silence my phone. Sorry, everybody. Imagine how long it would take to build something like that. 
You know, more than a couple spilled soda cans. Yeah, it's one thing that's odd about this game. The voice acting is really well done, but it's so inconsistent volume level. Sometimes it's super quiet, sometimes it's super freaking loud. You've entered the living I'm tabletop game board. You shut your dirty mouth, dirty pig. Random encounters. Yeah, you can get those on the overworld and things run into your business. Business, business. Yeah, we did upgrade our bitrate. I'm the business! Up our bitrate a little bit again. Stream should look a little better. What have we Get morphed! Morphin' time! <laughs> I love the lines. Guns are pretty advanced for only having been discovered Level recently. Hi. Oh, you're higher level than I am? What's up with that? Couldn't tell ya. I'm at like 97% of a level. Fun. Not as fun as being at 100% of a level! You shut your whore mouth. Yeah, there also is no, like, PvP in this. In other games, you can slap people and do, like, a challenge. Not a like thing here. Punch him. Yes. Punching things is okay. always the answer. There's oh, there's level three. Oh, man. This is the best. I am so glad you guys are here to play games and be friends. It's just been me in this cave with the bunbos and like a mountain of marshmallow cereal for like ever. Ah, oh, Tina, have you been the marshmallow? No, that Get sounds on, terrible. I got friends. I got tons of friends. Love that. Look, look at all these hotties, hottie bun face. Get put in another What's point. Up, giant ass cousins, head. And these are his cousins from out of state. And why are they ticking? I'm so glad you asked because they are also bombs. Great, nice. Bomb to boys. Dimitri. Wanna go this way? I'm putting in a point and doing my level quick. The ruins of a shrine dot the landscape. Though its builders are long forgotten and its magic crystals scattered, perhaps who or what ever it exalts would reward you for restoring it. Yeah, punch the shit. Yeah, I love like the figurine character looks on this. Look how big my head looks again. What's up with that? Well, you gotta remember, my character has a tiny head. Oh, you're like, tiny, the tiniest head boy. the head gets. So now it looks normal on the campaign map. Oh, there's a thing here. Her coruscating majesty, Queen Buttstallion, has long protected the Wonderlands with the sole oh, yeah, baby. into the land itself. But such a precious role requires guarding as well, as proven by the terrible events at Dragonkeep. And so the queen founded a new walled city from which to oversee. Woo! New walled city! Right type. The seat of the adamant throne. Yep. No I do adamant. have subtitles on, but when it starts like overlaying audio, like the subtitles get messed up. I don't know why. Even if it brings you to the brink of death, leaving you totally vulnerable. Yeah! That's right, boy. Get skeleton racked. Where are you running, skeleton? He's evasive. Not so tough now, are you? All right, you're getting the full treatment, bud. You turn him into a skeep? Yeah, that's my ability. 
Skeep time! Getting skeepy with it. Get wrecked! Oh yeah, barrels are super gnarly in this game. They're like, damn yep. one shot, yeah. All the way to end game. If you don't become a tanky character, barrels will one shot you. So don't stand next to them ever. I found my brittle bones. Brittle bones. I bet his friends make fun of him for having such brittle bones. Oh, that's a trap. Get him, bud. Nice. Oh, I hate fighting on steps. It's so awkward. Mwah. Stop calling me. Destroyed. There we go. Who else wants a little? You want some? Come here, bud. You, you can have some. Oh yeah, that's right. I don't have to be nearly as cautious with this ammo. Not even a little bit. Get him, skull boy! Yes, you have a very ammo demanding build on your other character. Oh yeah. <laughs> My other character, it's like, I need all the ammo we've ever had. Yeah, whenever I polymorph them, you have a chance to cast your spell on them for free. And it's guaranteed the first time you do it, or the first time you hit them. My unlimited so it's like, free spells cast. Oh, that's better. That gives me spell cooldown on melee hit. To work on badasses or bosses. What? Oh, it's a melee hit. Works on everything. Turn him into a skeep. Polymorph. I don't know, not bosses, but if it doesn't turn enemies that are immune. Um. Let's see. See. Da, da, da. If the enemy's immune. Free. You instantly cast a free spell on it and get two stacks of spell weaving. Oh, okay. So you still get something. It always felt bad in previous games. They're like, oh, your action skill literally doesn't work on any bosses or like big enemies. It's like, wow, this, this feels real bad. Like, what is that business? Come on. Get him, boys! Yeah, this gun shoots like little homing bats that hit him with dark damage. And in this game, dark damage is its own type that uh, heals your health. And my aim's not that good, so this gun's perfect for me. This whole thing Oh yeah, let's get him, boy. I actually really enjoy playing through the campaign in this game. I mean, I haven't done it a bunch of times like I have in the other games, but it seems cool. And the one good thing that they did, I feel, is that they made all of the little side quest collecting pieces actually matter. They give you statistic buffs for your character. If not your account. Yes, it's very nice. Instead of just being like, you got it, hooray. That's probably just a coincidence. 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 Are you using a shotgun? Yes. It's got two barrels. One for me, one for you. Yes. Yeah, I can really only get random encounters in like the tall grass. 
or in the later part of the game, they just are like, oh, everywhere is tall grass. Oh no, not backstab. Didn't see that coming. Maybe he stabbed himself. Yes, he didn't backstab us. He was backstabbed. Oh, random encounter again? I blame you for trying. You're seriously gonna summon me in this fight. Yeah, buddy. Bubble four. Yeah, you're a little bit ahead of me. Huh. Didn't think I was gonna make that jump for a second. There's four. Level four, that is. Yeah, max level in this game is only 40 now. They've decreased it quite significantly over the previous games. But there's also myth rank, which adds a bunch of stuff, kind of like badass rank previously. There's like an actual like skill tree component slightly. It's not that significant, but. What kind of weapons are you thinking about using with that too and they're big? Whatever drops, that's good. Ah, uh, yes, the old standard. Bridge. 